All right, so we're out here on Gold Mint Trail. Uh, the round trip that we're doing is about 16 miles. Levi and I are gonna hike at least, is it Gold Mint Hut or whatever? Which is about eight miles. If the weather's good and we feel a little, uh, a little spicy, we're gonna go up to Bomber Glacier. But that round trip is about 20 miles. So we will see. I might soak my feet in the water. All right, so we just got to the five mile point and we got about eight and a half more, sorry, we have about eight and a half total. So we got a few more miles till we're at the hut and we'll make a determination if we're gonna continue or not. Well, we saw a porcupine and we thought it was a bear cub for a second. It was a little scary. And now we're looking for a place to stop and make some coffee. Before we climb up the mountain. What's up? How's it going? Good. It's going. Taking a break. Nice. Let's some coffee. You coming down or going up? We're going up. We're going up. We're going up. We're We took a break, about five and a half miles. We had some coffee, had some dinner, recharged the batteries. Oh, almost fell. This looks like maybe that way. We recharged our batteries a little bit and we're working our way up the mountain now. Probably about six miles in. Debating on whether or not we're gonna keep going. Looks like the, not the remaining of the trail, but at least it's a little bit, these large boulders that we have to hop over. Try not to break our ankles. Parkour. Doing some parkour. Parkour, parkour. All the good stuff, all the fancy things.
which honestly is a nice little break compared to the wet marsh. Mo um, what are they called? Not mogs. Is that a word? A bog? Bog. Marshy bogs. Like Maybe our feet will dry out a little. I think it's this way. You must have been a lieutenant in a prior lifetime. We barely have a trail now. We're hopping over boulders mostly. Kind of going up through here. I'm trying not to break our ankles. It's actually the best park that we've had. So, where, where do we say we probably went seven miles now? Uh, yeah, I think probably about that seven mile mark. Uh, the trail's really good now. The last probably mile or half a mile, uh, we were just trailblazing through some pretty terrible underbrush and doing some rock hopping. But we made it through. Got a killer waterfall up there that hopefully we'll see soon and lots of birds
All right, so we're up in the it for the day, going to the uh, river to get a little bit of water for breakfast. Making some coffee right now. Levi just woke up. He's getting his jet boiler ready for his breakfast. Um, he's got like a country skillet or something like that. And I am sticking with the good old fashioned biscuits and gravy. camp for last night. So we made it up to the Gold Mint Trail Hut. Somebody's sleeping inside it. It's ultimately a pretty decent hike. We went up about a thousand foot elevation since we woke up this morning. We're hiking back down to get our packs. And then we're gonna hike another seven miles out. It's 8.3 total today, but another seven out. All right, so we're back down at the campsite and it's about nine o'clock. We're gonna start heading back towards the truck. We have about seven miles to go. And we'll see how much quicker it is to go back down the mountain compared to going up. Well, it was a pretty beautiful hike. It's uh, pretty extensive. If you don't prepare for it, it's gonna be kind of painful. We weren't sure if we were gonna try to go all the way up to the Bomber Glacier, which is a 20 mile round trip. Um, you go up, you come back in a different spot. 
but we're doing about a 16 mile round trip. Doesn't sound like a big difference, but those four miles is climbing up and over mountains. Um, it's like another like 3,000 feet of elevation gain, and it's over a couple of glaciers. So ultimately, it would have been a lot of fun, but I'm too tired to do that. And uh, maybe we'll do something like that in the future, though. We're just going to take it nice and slow and work our way down the mountain.